In this video, we want to look at the first example of integration by substitution. And the integral is x squared plus 1 quantity squared times 2x dx. From the first video, again, there are two important principles that we, or characteristics that we need to look for in order to use integration by substitution. The first one is that there is function composition. Well, we see we have function composition. We have x squared plus 1 all to the second power. So the inside function would be x squared plus 1. The outside function would be something squared. We also have the derivative of the inside function, which is 2x, showing up as a multiplier on the outside of the function composition. So this is a situation that meets the criteria to use integration by substitution. We let u equal the inside function, which is x squared plus 1. We take the derivative of u with respect to x, and that's 2x. We rewrite in differential form, and that step can be skipped. You can go right from u equals x squared plus 1 to du is equal to 2x dx. And now you can see that u is x squared plus 1, and du is simply 2x dx. So we swap out the x squared plus 1 for u, the 2x dx for du, and we rewrite simply as the integral of u squared du. And we know how to integrate u squared. That's simply going to be u to the third over 3 plus c, swapping out u for x squared plus 1. We get x squared plus 1 to the third power over 3 plus c. Now you can pause the video and try this same process with the integral x squared minus 1 to the third power times 2x dx. Pause the video, and in a few seconds, I will give you the answer to see whether you got that right. Okay, so you should have gotten x squared minus 1 to the fourth power over 4 plus c. If you got that, you can go on to the next video. If not, I'll work through the process here. We start with x squared minus 1 to the third power times 2x dx. We note that we have function composition. The inside function is x squared minus 1. Its derivative, which is 2x, shows up on the outside. And so we have the criteria to use integration by substitution. We let u equal the inside function, x squared minus 1. We take the derivative of u with respect to x and get 2x. Rewrite in differential form. We note that that's exactly what we have at the end of our integral expression, 2x dx. We'll let that equal du. We can then rewrite in the simpler form, all in terms of u. And so we get the integral of u to the third du. To integrate, we increase and divide. We get u to the fourth over 4 plus c. Swap out the u equal to x squared minus 1. And we end up with x squared minus 1 to the 4th power over 4 plus c. All right, we'll go on to another example in the next video.